you have a hiccup centre in your brain, uh, think about being born. Mm. So for the first nine months of your life, you're floating around in my favourite organ, the uterus. Do you have a favourite organ? Ooh. Not yet. The you, skin, because it's the largest. Oh, no, I'm with <laughs> you on that one. It's your own personal space. We could even start up a song here. You've got to have skin, skin, skin to keep your insides in, in, in. <laughs> you've been on the floor, you've been falling out the floor. Okay. Um, do you have a favourite amino acid? Oh, not yet. I'm, I'm you big on tyrosine. But anyway, okay. so you, you spend the first six months of your life, nine months, floating mm. around, drinking your own urine. Oh, gross. <laughs> uh, amniotic fluid. Mm. And so your lungs are moving liquid okay mm -hmm. one cubic meter of air nothing mm -hmm. 1.2 1. kilograms one cubic meter of war of water a thousand kilograms mm -hmm. and when you get born you have to switch over from moving liquid to moving air oh. and you don't get a practice run mm -hmm. this is it you're landing you, you're, you're landing and you're coming out and you've got to switch over. You're getting your oxygen through the umbilical cord, mm. so you're okay. You can, you, you can keep alive, but you've got to do that switch over. How do you train the lungs to get the muscle tone? Mm. Hiccuping. Hiccups. So <laughs> you spend about three quarters of an hour every day mm. before you get born hiccuping away. That sounds exhausting. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we, it, it, there have been cases of people hiccuping for days, mm. months. The record is of the order of over half a century. <sighs> and according to the report, it was cured by some, and I quote, very fierce praying. <laughs> okay. Go figure. <laughs> Whatever works, and eh? That, right? And so hiccuping is absolutely essential mm. for maturing the baby's lungs so that when they come out and suddenly they're not shifting liquid but they're shifting air, mm. they can shift that first bit of air and you and me, we shift five litres of air a minute and then sort of pro rata for size as you get younger, so maybe one or two litres a minute. You've got to shift that and keep on doing it for the rest of your life. And hiccuping is a training mechanism. In adults, it seems to have no function apart from being really annoying. <laughs> That's right. <laughs>